bring in a new vessel, even if it costs me my life. Welcome, ladies and gentlemen, to Naruto Ultimate Ninja 3. After Naruto left Shikamaru to fight that weird flu chick, he ran after Kimimaru. And Kimimaru is a really weird character because he can make his bones as a shield and a knife. It says Kekagenkai, which is slang for having some bullshit ass powers. And honestly, this is the strangest fight in this game because it doesn't make any sense in the story because as far as I'm aware Naruto wasn't able to do jack shit against Kimimaru because his bones were so strong or some shit and Naruto even summoned like an army of clones and they weren't able to do jack shit until Lee showed up and then that's a whole other thing but I don't really know why this fight is in here because it's just filler I don't understand you could have just gone straight to the Lee fight and everything would have been fine but yeah in case you didn't know Kimimaru is sick during this fight I think it has like some sort of heart or lungs disease or some other shit and the only way that he fights is with spirit or whatever the hell he means by that. And he still kicks Naruto's ass, which shows you how fucking weak Naruto is. The only way he survives with, is his, with uh, Fox Boy powers. And without that, he's completely useless. Honestly, Kimaru is kind of useless too. Because the only jutsu we see him perform really is his weird bone knives or whatever. And yeah, it's useful, I guess, but it's kind of dumb, too. Well, I'll see you guys next time. Please like, share, subscribe, comment, all that nonsense. Goodbye. I sense a strange form of chakra within you. Hand over Sasuke! <laughs> hey, Sasuke! Where are you going? No. <gasps> Be gone. Who are you? The handsome devil of the Leaf Village. Rock Lee! Bushy Brown. Naruto. Let me take care of this one. Brow. I'm counting on you!